go to the Hanagata building. Alright, after this I'm calling it a wrap for this recording session. Listen, old geezer. If you're Saya's father, why don't you pay off her debt? And we'll forget about making that porn video. How... how much? For the bar debt, 200,000 yen. Add some interest to that. Let's call it an even 4 million. Shoto borrowed money from an associate of ours. That's why the interest is so high. Fuck off! <laughs> If you can't pay us, then we'll just have to have a little talk with Saya. Huh. Uh. Shota, you okay? The fuck, you piece of shit! This asshole's a fucking pig! Huh. Section 4. He's in the organized crime unit. For real? Fuck, this is bad, man! Chill out. Hey, old man. Since you're in Section 4, you probably have access to a shitload of guns, right? What? If you run some of those hot pieces over to us, I'll forget about Saya's debt. How about it? We got a deal? No deal. Go fuck yourself. Stop trying to act so tough. Shota, why? You're a deadbeat dad. You couldn't give two shits about your daughter. Could you? Fuck you. Stupid shit. You lay even one finger on her, I'll kill you. Then I guess that seals the deal. I'm... Saya's father. And... a good cop. There's no way in hell I'd accept your offer. So you're saying... you don't care what happens to Saya, right? Your job takes precedence over your daughter? Kill me. Excuse me? I said kill me. If I die here, the police won't stop hunting you. You'll be fucked. The Japanese police aren't as soft as you think. Plus, Sai is safe. My friend will take good care of her. Well, if you insist... You know, we really aren't afraid of any fucking pigs. We had nothing to lose, you arrogant fucking asshole. Dad! Who the fuck are you? Motherfucker. So you've been working side by side all this time. You're a bunch of pussies. All of you. Ooh, we still swear. I'll show you what I'm made of. Happening faster than you've seen it. Ow. I'm gonna fucking kill you. This isn't Two hundred thousand to four million. I assume that's a joke, but I'm not laughing. N no. 
Show me the papers. I owe you one, Kazuma. Forget about it. Dad! You look like any other high school girl now. Ooh! Don't say things like that! Dad. That's rad. Saya, I'm a horrible father. I ran away from you and your mother ten years ago. So, I know I don't have the right to preach to you. But still, I want you to promise me one thing. Have a little more respect for yourself. Saya, you're a good girl. You just need to believe it. Nevertheless, when you're in trouble, or if you're in danger, I'll be there for you. You can count on me. Always. Okay. I promise. Please don't cry. Kazuma. Good morning, Detective Date. Chief, what's wrong? Yeah, we need to talk. You wanted to speak to me? Ten years ago, you disobeyed orders and continued to investigate a case we closed. This led to the demotion to your current position. I certainly hope you wouldn't make the same mistake twice. Well, no. Let me cut to the chase. I'm pulling you off the case as of right now. Which case exactly? Don't bullshit me. Date, you're off the case. You're dismissed. I've got to go. Hey, Date! That's Detective Date? Yes. What do you think, Sudo? That Yakuza, he's working with Detective Date? Correct. I can't say who, but we've been asked to investigate. This is an order straight from the top. Can you have Homicide take care of it? No problem. Kazuma. Hey, Kazuma. Take a look at this. What's this? This morning we found this corpse in Tokyo Bay. This tattoo? The cause of death was loss of blood due to blunt force trauma to the head. Body was weighed down with cinder blocks and thrown into the bay. There's signs of torture as well. Is it Mizuki? I can't say for sure, but the tattoo, isn't it the same as the one Mizuki has? Looks like. What's up? Take a closer look, around here. Looks like the character for Uta, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. That means it's the work of Utabori II, the master tattoo artist. He always leaves a signature somewhere on his pieces. So, you're saying this corpse was tattooed by this Utabori? Yeah, I had my back done by him. He should be in the Ryujin building, located somewhere between Senryo Avenue and Pink Street. If the woman in the picture is in fact Mizuki, we must never tell Haruka. Yeah. I'm gonna step out for a bit. Be careful. What an awful present. Get out there. Hey.
Alright. I gotta get to a save point and I gotta call it a wrap. Is there a... Yeah, there's a thing here.